Who wants to crave and save? Marie Callender's brings you handcrafted meals and amazing deals. The Crave and Save menu, six to nine bucks. Gooey gourmet grilled cheese with bacon. Quiche with a handmade buttery crust. Hearty fish and shrimp plate. Oh yeah, Crave and Save breakfast? Served all day. The new Crave and Save menu, 16 handcrafted meals for just six to nine bucks. And come on in to see which delicious pie is on sale for just $7.99. You get it. You know you can get great style and great savings at Ross. So if you're looking for the latest styles for spring, the best selection in your size at unbeatable savings, you got to go to Ross. An update now on that breaking news in Cerritos. A possible deputy-involved shooting, and there's one car that has crashed into a fire hydrant. Stu Mandel is live overhead with the latest. Stu. Pat and Paul, the Cerritos neighborhood, now a crime scene out here. You can see that crash scene right there, but there's also another crime scene a little bit farther into this neighborhood. Over here at the 13,000 blocks of Palms Place, you can see officers or deputies have this area cordoned off right there. A lot of crime scene, two vehicles right there. We believe that's one of the crime scenes, and then that vehicle may have fled to this location that where that crash occurred. We do know for a fact that there is a crash out here, or was a crash out here, into a hydrant and also took down a power pole. That well, Those wires still are active. That's the reason why deputies have not approached that vehicle. Unclear if there's a suspect still inside that car. Also, the sheriff's department saying that there is a good possibility there was a deputy involved shooting. Right now, they're trying to work out if that shots were fired from the suspect or from a deputy. Live from Sky 2 over the Cerritos area, I'm Stu Mandel. Pat and Paul, back to you. Chino Hills detectives have arrested two men who they say are responsible for a robbery spree across four Southern California counties. Investigators say the suspects used a machete. CBS 2 Orange County reporter Michelle Geely tells us how they were caught. Really? <laughs> I didn't know that. <laughs> a humble yeah. reaction from an Orange County man who is credited today with giving detectives a key clue that helped crack a string of violent, unsolved robberies throughout the Southland. We're talking machete, handgun, uh, pointing it at the uh, store clerks, uh, counting down uh, one to 20, uh, Give me all the money you have. This man identified as 20 year old Anthony Odie wearing a surgical mask and gloves now arrested allegedly robbed at least 17 convenience stores and pizza parlors maybe more from Chino Hills to LA and Orange counties. Police say he had a getaway driver 20 year old Richard Gomez Quiroz. It was that white car leaving a parking lot near a Santa Ana mobile station that caught the eye of the Good Samaritan we'll call Manny. He was suspicious right off the bat. Why did he park there? There, there are cones there already. So I, 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 I observed and then that's it. The guy came running. Oh, I think that's something to do. I mean, it's, they did something, something bad or wrong. So I got, you know, I got the instinct of getting the license plate. A license plate which led to the suspects. Detectives want to know whether there are even more robbery victims who've been too afraid to come forward. In Santa Ana, Michelle Geely, CBS 2 News. Horse riders already know how therapeutic it is, and now others are getting the same experience thanks to Ride On in Chatsworth. In this evening's California Dreams, CBS 2's Josh Rubenstein shows us how the horses provide mental and physical healing. A slow trot on a quiet afternoon. More than a fun ride, this is a key component to Holly Herpick's physical therapy. She is nonstop um, progressing. She's very moving forward. Holly's mom, Miho, noticed her little girl was missing several key milestones in her development. She was concerned. Mainly because she had a low muscle tone. So everything delayed. Her eyes didn't focus oh. for a long time. She had a, a problem in swallowing. So along with traditional forms of therapy, Miho called on the folks at Ride On for help. And we basically provide two services here, a therapeutic riding program where we actually teach our clients to learn to ride, walk, trot and canter. And we also have a therapy services program. She's using the movement of the horse for whatever specific medical improvements the therapist is working on. Animal assisted therapy has been around for more than 100 years. The bond that humans and domesticated animals share is incredibly powerful. Well, in 1952, uh, one of the uh, Swedish um, Olympic dressage riders had polio and found that riding um, strengthened her muscles. 
It's called adaptive horseback riding and it combines sport, recreation and education for therapy. A lot of our kids that come out here are either in wheelchairs or they're in walkers and they don't ever get a chance to be on top of a really powerful uh, animal and look down and see the world from a different perspective. But it's more than just physical. People who struggle with emotional and mental conditions also benefit from precious time with these animals. You spend a little time with the horses here at Ride On and you can see how easy it is to quickly bond with the animals. In fact, it's that bond that makes a huge impact in what's called equine assisted psychotherapy. This modality helps to decrease depression. It helps to decrease anxiety. It helps to foster self-esteem. Therapist Barbara Levine is particularly proud of Rydon's work with veterans, especially vets. Who come back with, you know, post-traumatic stress disorder, anxiety disorders, depression, substance abuse, they come back and they have a myriad of things that they have to deal with. Barbara says a few sessions can bring out life-changing revelations. Well, we had one gentleman, he went out in the arena and all the horses ran from him. And he had the insight when he watched that, he said, those horses are afraid of me just like my kids are right now. It is a special relationship, the therapist and patient. Although here at Ride On, that therapist has four legs. And I think that they understand what they're doing here. I'd like to think that. Um, I think they're more patient than most people. <laughs> Hi. And they're very friendly. Holly's afternoon trot is just coming to an end, but it's clear the road ahead for her may be very long. However, with the help of some patient volunteers and a trusted steed by her side, the ride will be that much easier. And that's another California dream. For CBS2 News, I'm Josh Rubenstein. And Ride On will be handling all of the equestrian activities for this summer's World Special Olympic Games here in Los Angeles. For more information about Ride On or to see other California dreams, check out cbsla.com slash California dreams. Well, this is a bold step by parents who have children with autism. See why they're donating their child's brain to science. Also, talk about oversharing online. An alleged bank robber records his heist and posts it on Instagram. CBS 2 News is sponsored by Lone Depot. Call 866-888-LOAN. Lone Depot is better than banks. That's right. I said it. Better than banks. Lone Depot is a direct lender. So you get faster approvals and faster closings, which means you start saving money faster. Refinance at today's low fixed rate at just 2.75%. With our lifetime guarantee, your rates will stay low. Because if interest rates ever drop, you can refinance with Loan Depot without any appraisal or lender fees. Southern California Edison wants to help you and your family stay safe around electricity. Always stay at least 10 feet away from power lines. Stay aware. Stay safe. Everyone knows Sit and Sleep has the biggest selection of beds. But did you also know we have everything for the bedroom too? The largest selection of headboards and footboards. Nightstands. Lots of dressers. Daybeds. Even beds with storage, plus sheets, pads, and pillows, including memory foam, latex, and down. So for a new bed or a whole new bedroom, come to Sit and Sleep. Sit and Sleep will beat anyone's advertised price or your mattress is free! Hey, can we help with that? Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, well, in five years' time, we could be walking around a zoo with the sun shining down over me and you. And there'll be love in the bodies of the elephants, too. And I'll put my hands over your eyes, but you'll be through. And there'll be love. Introducing the one and only Volkswagen Golf Sport Wagon, the sportier utility vehicle.
CBS 2 News is sponsored by The Flame Broiler, a healthy choice. Many parents are overlooking a condition that could have lifelong consequences. And how families hope to help researchers understand autism. CBS 2's Lisa Siegel is here with today's Health Watch. Lisa. Yeah, it's pretty important. Hi, you guys. Hello, everyone. First, it seems people who identify later in life as gay or transgender are bullied even before middle school. The New England Journal of Medicine reports that by fifth grade, 13% of children who later identified as LGBT reported being teased or bullied on a weekly basis. That compared to 8% for other kids. This bullying often starts even before the kids are aware of their sexual orientation. Researchers say peers may pick on them for being different and the consequences can be devastating. Well, also a warning tonight for parents. Be on guard when it comes to childhood obesity. Yale researchers say many parents are oblivious to their children's weight problem. And if it's not addressed early, it can be hard for their child ever to reach a healthy weight. The message to parents, focus on eating well, getting the child active, and of course, being supportive. And finally on Health Watch, some parents of children with autism are taking a very bold step, all to help researchers understand the condition. Andrew Koch loves to bake with his mom. The 18-year-old has autism. Between one and one and a half, it kind of became clear he wasn't doing the interactive play that other children did. His mom, Carol, knows research is critical to understanding the causes of autism. So she signed up for Autism Brain Net. The brain of a patient with autism. The new nationwide research program is enrolling families willing to donate the brains of their loved ones to science after death. To study the disease in a way that is currently not possible and with that new information to open new avenues for potential treatments. Four universities are collecting brain tissues, which will then be supplied to scientists conducting research. What else? More than 7,000 families have signed up for Autism Brain Net, including the Koch family. This could really make a difference for future generations. Carol now speaks to other families, hoping their donations to research will bring scientists closer to finding a cure. Now, research shows the structure of autistic brains is different than typical brains. Doctors hope with more information, they, of course, can come up with better treatments. That's the hope. Yeah. All right. Thank you, Lisa. Up next, McDonald's continues trying to make over its image. The surprising item now being served at some local restaurants. I'm Suzanne Marquez, live in Hollywood at the premiere of Mad Max Fury Road. Much more in Ion Entertainment. Tonight at 11, addicted to your email, phone, anxiety over posting the perfect picture. I felt sort of like a prisoner to my digital world. Take the test. Find out if it's time you begin a digital detox. Tonight at 11 on CBS 2 News. Gummy Drop. Download it free today. Join the almost 2 million Southern California drivers who have their auto insurance through the Auto Club. I didn't know how easy it was to just switch auto insurance. The money that I saved by moving to AAA insurance went into my son's tuition fund. After comparing a few other rates, you know, it was clear that AAA was our best place to be. As an Auto Club member, you could save up to $386 a year. Compare that to State Farm, Allstate, or Farmers. You could save even more with AAA discounts. My agent kept finding me more and more discounts, and who wouldn't be into that? Even get a $100 travel certificate when you switch. Best of all, get the service we're famous for and peace of mind. When you walk in their office and they can call you by name, it's pretty nice. The story of my savings is a very happy one with a very happy ending. At the Auto Club, my job is to help you get more AAA out of your AAA card. And that starts with great savings on auto insurance. Call 800-719-2041. The Auto Club. So easy, so smart, so switch. 
CBS Tonight, the biggest bang of the year is finally here. That was really intense. With one big moment. Vegas isn't that far away. I'm in. Let's do it. That's been eight years in the making. I'm really happy for the two of you. Thank you. Now get out of my spot. The Big Bang Theory season finale. Then nothing's bigger or odder. What's up, Sergeant Pepper? Then back-to-back -back episodes. It is quite the educational tool. And so are you. Back-to-back -back episodes of The Odd Couple after the Big Bang season finale, CBS Tonight. It's Sammy's Camera No Tax Mother's Day Sale. Save 50 on DJI's Phantom Quadcopter with GoPro mount for only $349. Copter includes radio remote control and is ready to fly. Plus, no tax at Sammy's Camera. The Picasso at the Wheel Summer Tour, starring Train. Did you finally get the chance to dance? May 24th, Hollywood Bowl. Train with special guest, The Fray. And Matt Nathanson. Tickets are on sale now at Ticketmaster.com or charge by phone. Train, produced by Andrew Hewitt and Bill Silver Presents in association with Live Nation. Aerial coverage from Sky 2 is brought to you by Stater Brothers, where you always get more for less. In today's Eye on Entertainment, it's been nearly 30 years since the last Mad Max movie was on the big screen. Tom Hardy takes over as Max in this fourth installment of the post-apocalyptic thriller. CBS 2 Entertainment reporter Suzanne Marquez joins us live from the Hollywood premiere of Mad Max Fury Road. Suzanne. Paul, it is an exciting action-packed film. Of course, Tom Hardy's in it, as well as Charlize Theron. And there's a lot of strong female characters. You know, it was an interesting dynamic, and I've never really worked with a lot of women. I like my movies are usually with men. It's strange, or and to to be able to work with the you know this. I mean, they're little powerhouses. Fury Road is here, the fourth installment in the series. It has been three decades since the last one. Tom Hardy takes over the role of Max, who meets a woman named Furiosa, played by Charlize. She's attempting to cross an immense desert with her four former female captives, also known as the Five Wives. When Max is taken captive, it's up to the women to save him as well as themselves. George Miller, the man behind the franchise, wrote and directs the film Mad Max Fury Road in theaters next Friday. Sofia Vergara was honored with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame today. The Colombian actress began her career in a Pepsi commercial and has been nominated for an Emmy, Golden Globe and SAG Award. By her side this afternoon, her Modern Family co-stars. Vergara's latest film, Hot Pursuit, is in theaters tomorrow. Now, last night, Mariah Carey kicked off her residency in Las Vegas. Mariah number one to infinity features all 18 of her number one hits plus the just released ballad infinity fans say she hit all of the high notes that made her the highest selling female artist of all time. Now a big fan of the Big Bang Theory who's battling terminal cancer has her wish granted. Friends of the 13 year old British girl posted on Instagram that her wish was to get a message from a member of the cast and Kayla Cuoco sweeting made it happen. Hi Nicole. My name is Kaylee. I heard you love the Big Bang Theory, so I just wanted to say hi from my closet. Um, my hair's a little pink if you don't recognize me. You can catch Kaylee Cuoco Sweeting in the season finale of the Big Bang Theory at 8, followed by an hour of The Odd Couple at 8.30, another episode of Big Bang at 9.30 p.m., with an all-new elementary at 10, and of course, stay tuned for CBS 2 News at 11. Now we're going to be covering Mad Max premiere, and you can catch it on KCAL 9 News at 8. Reporting live in Hollywood, I'm Suzanne Marquez. Pat and Paul, back to you. All right, thank you, Suzanne. The place known for super sizes is now serving a super food. Kale is on the menu at select McDonald's across Southern California. It comes in a turkey sausage and egg white bowl, which also has spinach and bruschetta. It's part of the chain's efforts to shake its junk food image. McDonald's restaurants in Canada are also testing three salads with kale.
Well, time now to check back in with Jackie Johnson. She actually has some weather to talk about. Yeah, she sure does, Jackie. That's right, today and tomorrow. But first, we wanted to show you this beautiful live shot. We're over Cerritos looking toward Torrance. And you can see we've had gloomy conditions all day, but it sure is nice to see those sun rays shining through the breaks in the clouds. Uh, the clouds that are now bringing showers, snow, and even thunderstorm activity to our mountain areas. Uh, the first area that saw the thunderstorm activity earlier today was in Ojai. Now you can see another cell starting to move in. And that includes, uh, we're also seeing some snow with that one. Uh, this right here is producing lightning. So I want to show you this, put it into motion. There was the thunderstorm uh, cell that moved over Ojai. And now this is the one that's moving into L.A. County. And that will be the trend as this area of low pressure drops in tonight. We will have the best chance of rain tomorrow morning. I'll have more on this coming up at 6. Paul, back to you. Thank you, Jackie. Now look ahead to the top of the hour and what's coming up also on CBS 2 News at 6. Burglars break into an Encino home with the residents sitting in another room completely unaware. Now the suspects were able to get in and out undetected. Plus, a new type of student center coming to schools in the UC system with a very specific focus. And getting a different kind of buzz at the barber. The effort by a local lawmaker to allow salons and barber shops to serve free beer and wine to customers. These stories and more next at 6. Also next, an alleged bank robber records his own heist, and what he did with the video was not very bright. Plus, how a couple of kids used the Bible to silence a bully. I work in healthcare, a technology company. I work in hospitality. And the Society for Human Resource Management is working for us. With 275,000 members, we're helping organizations thrive in a rapidly changing workplace. SHRM's competency-based certifications are setting the new standard arming HR pros with skills that make the new workplace work. Advancing HR. So your workforce takes you where you want to go. SHRM, the leading resource for human resources. I don't want to live with the uncertainties of Hep C. Or wonder whether I should seek treatment. I am ready. Because today, there's Harvoni, a revolutionary treatment for the most common type of chronic hepatitis C. Harvoni is proven to cure up to 99% of patients who've had no prior treatment. It's the one and only cure that's one pill once a day for 12 weeks. Certain patients can be cured with just eight weeks of Harvoni. With Harvoni, there's no interferon and there are no complex regimens. Tell your doctor if you have other liver or kidney problems or other medical conditions and about all the medicines you take, including herbal supplements. Harvoni should not be taken with any medicines containing amiodarone, rifampin, or St. John's wort. It also should not be taken with any other medicine that contains Sovaldi. Side effects may include tiredness and headache. I am ready to put Hep C behind me. I am ready to be cured. Are you ready? Ask your Hep C specialist if Harvoni is right for you. Reason 584, a full house. Morongo, good times. Tony Tantillo is brought to you by Marie's Chunky Blue Cheese Dressing. Dress a salad, serve it up on the side, or use it in a recipe. Available at Vons. It's Empire Today's biggest sale. 50% off carpet and flooring, 50% off padding and materials, and 50% off installation. 800-588-2300, Empire Today. Closed captioning on CBS2 is sponsored by Empire Today. A California man accused of robbing a bank in Virginia apparently gave incriminating evidence not just to detectives but to everyone online. 23-year-old Dominic Alfonseca says he went to a bank, handed the teller a note, and grabbed the cash. He recorded the crime on his cell phone and posted it on Instagram while still inside the bank. Officers arrested him 20 minutes later carrying a gym bag full of cash you think? Alfonseca, who calls himself a rap artist, believes he will not be found guilty in court because he never demanded the money. Well, instead of choice words, two Texas children gave a bully the word and it worked. Phoenix and Kingston Walwyn told their parents a bully was calling them names on the school bus. Dad prayed about it, then told his kids to give the young man a copy of the Bible. 
What happened at the end of the bus ride surprised them. We gave it to him and then like two minutes later when it was almost his stop to get off, he just said, thank you and sorry for all the bad stuff we did to you. Since that day, the name calling has stopped completely. Oh, that's good. Well, right after CBS 2 News at 6 is the CBS Evening News. Scott Pelley has a preview of tonight's broadcast. Hey, Pat and Paul, great to be with you in Los Angeles. Here's the CBS Evening News tonight. Twisters roll through America's heartland and more may be on the way. We're going to show you the damage that's already been done. Plus, Tom Brady weighs in on the Deflategate investigation. And orphans of war return to Vietnam seeking their long-lost families. We'll have those stories tonight on the Western edition of the CBS Evening News right after CBS 2 News at 6. Paul and Pat, back to you in L.A. Up next here at 5, they're not monkeying around. Why a zoo is having to apologize for the name of their new monkey. And ahead at 6, more on the breaking news in Cerritos. A deadly deputy-involved shooting. We'll have the latest. CBS 2 News is sponsored by Southern California's Stanley Steamer. Stanley Steamer is the first carpet cleaning service certified asthma and allergy friendly. It's our new standard of clean. Call about our $99 carpet cleaning special. Call 1-800-STEAMER. Stanley Steamer, your certified cleaner. Why wait to be yourself? Agua Caliente Casino Resort Spa. Do you wrestle with those old-fashioned hoses that tangle and kink? Are they heavy and hard to store? It's time to get the new Top Brass Professional Pocket Hose. I'm Paul James, the gardener guy, and you need the new Top Brass Professional Pocket Hose. Now the best-selling expandable hose in the world has been completely re-engineered. Top Brass uses Dura-Rib technology to create a flexible endoskeleton inside your hose that expands and contracts while the outer sleeve is tough like a fire hose, but soft to touch. You just can't kink this hose, even tied in a knot. Just turn on the water and it unties itself. Is that cool or what? And our industrial brass connectors seal tight and will not leak. Look, the other brands collapse under pressure, but Top Brass is so well made it crushed the competition. And Top Brass is the only expandable hose with a connector protector. We also increase the diameter to a full three quarter inches for faster flow and much more power. Just turn on the water and top brass grows. Turn the water off and away it goes. It's like it puts itself away. A Dura-Rib inner sleeve, a rugged outer sleeve, professional grade connectors, a three quarter inch diameter. The only one with a connector protector and still so lightweight, anyone can use it. That's the top brass. It's the last hose you'll ever have to buy. Call and get your top brass professional pocket hose today for just $19.99. There's more. You also get the Mighty Blaster Fireman's Nozzle, the only household sprayer with the power and precision of a real fireman's nozzle. Just twist for a misting spray, twist again for a powerful stream. You get it all, but you have to call. Call 1-800-448-0275 to get your special offer, Professional Strength Pocket Hose Top Brass. Call now or go to PocketHoseTopBrass.com. So call 1-800-448-0275. That's 1-800-448-0275. Don't miss out. Call now. Next DT, I'm talking with George Clooney all about his life at the mall. Then our Mother's Day countdown. She's my mom. Star lessons from my mom. Oh, don't cry. Uh, you make me. Next DT. Tonight at 7.30 on CBS2. Zoo officials in Japan are apologizing for naming a baby monkey Charlotte after the newborn British princess. They say they received angry calls from people who complained that giving them a cock that name is disrespectful.